Hi, this is Josh Olson. You're watching Trailers from Hell. Now imagine if the producers of the TV show Law & Order put out a feature film called Law & Order that came out while the show was still on the air that featured almost nobody from the show, uh, had none of the structural elements of the film, and in fact in which the police played barely a part at all, in which the movie was just about a bunch of killers running around knocking people off. Uh, that's kind of what we have today. It's Don Siegel's uh, film of the lineup. It's one of Eli Wallach's uh, earliest film performances, and it's absolutely fantastic. Let's take a look. This is a great opening for a trailer. It's also the opening of the film. It's action-packed, but uh, the next 10 minutes or so of the film are a little slow until the bad guys show up. The TV show, The Lineup, was about a couple of cops, mostly, just a procedural. And the movie has a couple of cops, uh, one of them from the TV show, the other one, uh, the great Emil Meyer, who is one of the great screen tough guys, probably best remembered as the corrupt cop in Sweet Smell of Success. But Don Siegel and writer Sterling Silifant were obviously not interested in the cops at all, because the film really comes to life when the bad guys show up. Eli Wallach in his second movie role after Baby Doll, and Robert Keith, who was Brian Keith's father. Wallach plays Dancer, a sociopathic hitman, and Keith plays Julian, his older, theoretically wiser handler, who tutors Dancer in proper language and always writes down the last words of Dancer's victims. It's a nice little touch. I, I like it. it. It may be a little bit writerly, but it's kind of fun. The movie has some incredible violence, including a wheelchair scene that rivals Richard Widmark's brutal granny down the staircase scene in Kiss of Death. It also makes great, great use of San Francisco locations, and Don Siegel obviously loved the city and the city loved him back because uh, more than a decade later he came back to make what was probably the greatest cop film of all time, Dirty Harry, and uh, he was given a lot of support by the San Francisco police uh, when he did that. There's one particularly useless scene in the lineup uh, where the cops hold a lineup. It's a well-shot scene, it's well-directed, it's pretty, it's a classic sort of Siegel puts the camera in the right place, everything's done right, but really serves no purpose except that there has to be a lineup in a movie called The Lineup that's allegedly a spin-off from a TV show called The Lineup. There's also a nice little rock and roll footnote to the film. At one point, Julian says that to be a criminal, you must be honest. That line, slightly altered, came back years later in Bob Dylan's song, Absolutely Sweet Marie, when Dylan sang, To live outside the law, you must be honest. I have to imagine that Dylan saw this film and loved it as much as I do.